Well, we welcome out Fiji and Drua onto Amy Park, and Meroi Thumu going to be a very important player for them, certainly up against a decent centres combination for the Rebels. As we do welcome the Melbourne Rebels out onto their home ground, they are winless so far in season 2024, but Ash Masters, she has been a pillar of strength and impact for, for their side all year. Inspire this Rebel side to an unlikely win. But we are underway, round five of the Super Rugby Women's 2024 season, and the Rebels let the ball bounce. Now it ends with Strip, a little carry, and it's stripped back. It's a dangerous ball, but there are plenty of white jerseys. Here's Thumu, and out they go, Vani right. Boone up on the far wing. Boone has been dangerous the past few weeks, and Boone is away. Boone going through the Rebels' defence and will charge under the posts. Adelaide Boone and the Fijian drew up a near perfect start. That is just Fiji at their finest. Goes to show that when you have possession against a pacey side like this, you've got to be able to treasure it. But ultimately, a strip ball from Tiara Mins deep in their own 22. Sees the ball force into broken play. Just look at this. The forwards had some nice go forward there, stripped off the ball. Fiji do a great job of just finding the hands of pacey winger, sorry, fullback Atalena Buna, who has been most impressive. Had her work cut out for her. But my goodness, there was definitely no stopping this woman once she was in space. What about the swerve and the curve of the pace that she displays to run away? It's a 103 metre try from behind their own goal line. No one in Super Rugby Pacific or Super Rugby Women's scores tries like this team. Kanita from directly in front, gets right underneath it. It is good and it is 7-0. A chance to change that and successfully does so. Cassie Siatanga, it is three points to seven. And they come, Matarungu, oh, excuse me, Nasewa. Sinikarivi working her way back, Thumu. All right, had to wait for it. And she's upended, dangerously so. No, 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 no. Yeah. Okay. Jason. Now, there is no TMO in the regular season. And we have the benefit of another look. Thoughts? Right, so That's incredibly dangerous. As soon as you tear past the point of horizontal, well, there is, no, there is no TMO, it's but the referees the are having a sneaky look at the ah, very clever. big screen. Ash? Yes. Ash, and number three, please. Number Happy three. for the Rebels. Let's see what Harry Fenton's verdict is. Lifting tackle. The player's landed on her shoulder. The yellow She's card. Broken. So, Tijuana Salto off for like 10 minutes. A yellow card. Right to the back near Pelusu. And good organisation from the Rebels here. They are okay, three out, three out. working their way through. No, brought down by Rebels. Play on. It's a tackle. And Mins at the back. A little run. Rebels playing 14 on 15 with Juana Salto in the bin for a dangerous tackle. Mays. Drew did well to close down the options. There's a slight overlap. Backwards. Hearn behind Pritchard. It's still going. Pritchard looking for a support run. And the Rebels playing almost Drew a football. Masters brought down about 12 away. And Mamea. See a tongue of good hands. Paraisa and Kawa. Kawa bundled towards the flag. Kahika skip up. The Rebels hit back. Can they've been playing some delightful rugby. Kahika skipper the score. Pretty decent strike. Outstanding work. Set! Well, they march the Rebels back now. They have the advantage. It's still at the feet of Nice with the skipper. 
They continue right, to control legs. things. Use it. Seneca Reeve fishes it out. Thumu. A couple away. Drua looking for try number two and the lead again. Strong defence from the Rebels. Under advantage, Fiji and Drua. Diving under. Try, Fiji and Drua. And they have the lead. Vika Matarungu returns to Amy Park after playing with the Rebels last year and she puts the Drua in front. So great to see Drua finally add some points to the board. Salonia to Kanita. Adds the extras. Job well done. A minute to half time. For the Rebels have another lead to take. Hamilton. Oh, Brown just throwing it into Nice Sawa. Very, very careful. And they're going to take the shot. So a chance to bring it to with one, but strong gamesmanship from Brown. Surely has been. That's just the decision making at the rock. <laughs> she saw her clearly not obstructing anything. But. What do you mean? <laughs> Not obstructing she's, anything. She's just chilling. She's right in the middle of the 910 channel. It's, it's she's funny. out of the way. She, but she's right there. How are you going to I know pass? she does, but Brown looks right it's at her. Hard. She doesn't even look at her own team. She doesn't have to. She's offside. I know that. The difference in facial expressions <laughs> from the two of them was something, wasn't it? Brown eyes for Nisewa. Nisewa <laughs> just hoping that everyone just forgot that she was there. <laughs> One of the masterful players of a halfback just played <laughs> into a body. Oh, that's brilliant. That's true. Well, half time has been sounded and the rebels will go into the sheds just one point adrift cassie see a tongue are kicking well and the rebels a big first half they still trail 14 to 13 but a lot to like and it sets it up beautifully for the second 40. time back on from harry fenton and we are underway in the second half Fiji and drew up Receive the kickoff from the Rebels. And oh, then I say what? A trademark strong carry. Use it! Hamilton. No hands off, let go! Immense contest from both sides at the moment. Now the Rebels go to the backs. Masters looking for the offload. No, balls A team leader in that. And his salto wrestled to the ground. Strong defence from the Drua. They are equal to it. A pile no, of bodies just in front of the posts. Leave it alone. A little bit stagnant from the Rebels here now. But Drua not holding their nerve. On the five, on the five. Yeah. On oh, the tap and Masters. Diving Masters. Slices through the Drua and the Rebels lead. What a solid response from this Melbourne Rebels side. They did the small things well to be able to value that possession. Phase after phase after phase. It's only going to be a matter of time before Fiji didn't get away with the penalties that they are giving away at the rock, just lying as dead bodies. Ash Masters asked quickly for the tap and strides over. I don't even think that Drua side was ready for her with no bodies marked up in front of her. That's well, brilliant deception. Milkar was calling for the points, and at the same time, a skipper said, give me the ball, I'm just going to run straight through the middle of everyone. No one was onside, no one was ready. No one wanted to tackle Ashley Masters, who puts her team in front. What a weapon she is. Very informal. And another big season. And Siatanga makes it 20 points to 14. Bind! Set. Oh, they're under pressure, the Rebels. The Drew have gone straight through the middle. Set. The Rebels pushing back and winning the penalty. Two standing up. Big stuff from them and against the tide at scrum time. The Rebels leading 20 to 14. They don't dare to dream just yet, but Mins brings it down. Nuku 
She scored five tries this year. She is the Rebels' all-time leading try scorer. The line-out's been impressive. It's yielded so many points. The Drua working them away. The Rebels inches away. Balls there, balls there. Salto! The Rebels having their way with this two-time defending champion, Fiji and Drua side. Salto, hailing from the Buna village in Tabuyuni, makes her statement known here in the second half against the Fijiana Drua. Look at the excitement. I've actually got goosebumps down my arm. A chance to make it 13. She's perfect from the tee this evening. Kashi Siatanga and the Rebels. So let me explain. We've had number 28 come from a distance, direct contact to the head with force. It will be a red card against her. I'm just waiting. A red card? Yeah, it will be a red card against her. I'm just waiting for her to get some treatment, OK? But that's what the outcome will be. So we'll be restarting with a penalty on the five metre line. A looping ball out to the far wing. Hamilton. Another good fan, Coravata stops her. Well done. Nuku. Freeman again. Salta wasn't Backwards. expecting it and Buna scoops it up. No one is stopping Adelaide Buna. And for the third time in two weeks, she streams away. Fatigue sets in. She dots it under and the Drua remain alive this evening. Atalatim Buna. What a woman. How unstoppable is she in space? Taking some much needed breaths after a huge runaway try on the back of a defensive effort. Sorry, attacking effort here from Melbourne Rebels. Couldn't quite find the hands of Ash Masters. And like a thief in the night, Buna just picks it up. No one back home. Backs herself, backs her pace and her ability. She was the best on ground last week against the Brumbies. And she's proving to do the same here at Amy Park. Well, hugely against the run of play. Probably the only way the Drew have looked like scoring. In the last little bit of this second half, and now suddenly, surely that sparks their energy. And the Rebels are under their post thinking, surely not. We've done so much hard work. There's a long nine minutes to go. Here they go, the Rebels. If they keep it up this end, they are a good thing. But a try will put a real stamp on things. Masters. Midfield. No, get out of there now. Well done. About 12 away. Salto, the try scorer. Here they go, the Rebels. Working away at a tied Fiji and Drew aside. Coming, step. Step. Well done. Two minutes to play. Masters no, rumbling it up. Well a try scorer herself. Salto again. Tyler's from the Rebels. Caravata, a big shot in defence. There it is, Nuku. Short. Hands up, hands up. The Rebels again, they're oh, over. That is the moment and no more fitting a player to charge over and dive there than Ash Masters. The Masters of this universe puts the Rebels into a famous victory. Thank you. And she's made a huge difference. She's moving back into the forward pack. Back where she belongs, back where she's close Rebels. to the action, and she can bring her power okay. game to the fore. Still be a yeah. And it's the most important 30 centimetre try you've ever seen for the Melbourne Rebels organisation. Okay. You've got 30 seconds now, okay? Kevin Foote, What's that? Rebels men's head coach, very impressed. That's it? Are you sure? Okay. The points are added, and they come from the boot of Grace Freeman. That is time. The Rebels win number two in Super Rugby women's history for them. And their first win in four years. They've done it. 
They've broken the drought. Look what it means to the Melbourne Rebels.